Yo guys, Scammer Vaults here, and today we're actually doing a long video, and I have a little announcement, it's, I've done it in the end of my videos, but I have, this, this is my website, it's not done yet, but, um, I have, we actually have some software on the website, actually, that sounded wrong, well that didn't sound wrong, but it didn't sound laid out right. So we have like two applications on here, there, um, this one's a web browser named Scammer's Web, and it just, so that's the basic browser um, functions, but it's named Scammer's Web. So I plan to use this as my um, main browser in a virtual machine when I call Scammer soon. Um, but I'm going to update it more before I actually do that so it doesn't glitch out a ton. Um, and we also have this one called Scammer Test, and I might use it in this video. Actually, let me download it. So basically, uh, for Scammer's Test, what it does is it's got it's just got a big button and it says is you a scammer and you click it and it says you is a scammer or it says xd i guess you are so it's just a troll program to mess with them because we obviously know that they are scammers but it's really fun to to mess around with um but yeah so that's pretty much it um we're gonna give them a call and let's freaking do this Hello. Welcome to the board body. How may I help you today? Hello. Yeah, I got a. I have a thing on my computer that says I have to call you guys. And since how long you have been getting this message? Um, I maybe got it ten or fifteen minutes ago. Right. Um, is it a, on on which browser you're getting it? In Google Chrome, it says. It has like an error code and it says please call us immediately. Okay. And what was the last thing you did on your computer? Um, I basically just turned it on maybe 20 minutes ago, came back, um, went, was just browsing around and then this came up. Okay. Yeah. Uh, please help me with your name. Yes, um, my first name is Tommy. My last name is Williams. Okay. All right, and um, are you in front of the computer so that I can help you with a couple of troubleshooting steps? Okay, yeah, I'm in front of it. Is that your personal computer? Um, yes. All right. Is it Windows 7? Is it? I mean, first of all, I would like to ask you if it's Windows or Mac. It's Windows. Okay, Windows 7, 8, 9, 10. Um, I I believe it's. I believe it's 10. Okay. And that's your personal computer, yeah? Yeah. Okay. And uh, what you what you could do is you can do you see Windows button on your keyboard? Um yes. In the left hand side corner. Yeah, I see it. Uh beside the control beside the control button it is. Yeah, yeah, I see it. It has four flag signs. And R letter R you can see on your keyboard? Um yeah. So you need to press Windows and R button together. Okay. Um, Alright, it says... It, press both the buttons together. Yeah, it, it, it just brung up a thing on my screen that says run. Very nice. And now type in there, I explore. I explore. Okay. After that, Put a space. Okay. And then uh, type in there www. 
Okay. Three times W dot zero one. Zero one. P as in Charlie, P as in Papa, U as in uniform. Okay. CPU dot com. Dot com. Okay. Hit enter. Okay. It says uh remote connect. Hello. All right. So, what have you got on your screen? Yeah, it says support buddy remote connect. Okay, click on that. Okay. Yeah, it says step one, step two, and step three. It says step one, yeah. type the connection oh, oh, code. Okay, I'll give you the connection code. Bear with me. Okay. So what's your email ID? My my email address? Yeah. Tommy Williams at gmail dot com. So, what do I do now? Hello. Hello. Yeah, the code is 898. Oh, uh, 898. 508. 508. Eight nine eight five zero eight. Yeah. Okay. And then click in the checkbox and then go ahead, click on the positive option. Okay. It says connect setup. Does extract, okay. copy, extract. Okay, it says uh, it's got a thing on the top. It says agent is working on your PC. Okay, fantastic. I have got the remote here. Before before I go ahead, I just need to take a verbal authorization from you. Do you authorize support body to go ahead and take the remote access of your computer? Uh, yeah. And close all your personal files and folders. And you also need to uh, be in front of the computer till the time we are fixing the issue. Okay. Okay. And uh, whenever you feel an uncomfortable or you've got to go, then you just need to press the red X button on your screen and we'll be disconnected. Like, okay. okay, let me check. Yeah, the pop up thing's right here. It's right there. Yeah. There. Were you getting the message on this? Okay, this is the one it is. And since how long you've been using this computer? Um, maybe a year or two years. Okay, a couple of years. And for what all use? I mean, what all the things you do on this computer, mostly? Uh, just use it for general Facebook, stuff. Facebook, surfing net. 
I really just use it for anything that I need to use it for. Just for your personal use, like shopping, banking, and like uh, using Facebook, checking yeah. things on internet. Yeah. See here, you can see this. Uh, it's showing here that all the Microsoft services have been stopped working because of this virus which has entered into your computer. You can see this? Yeah, I see that. So it's stopped. Yeah. Let me check. Yeah. Let me check a couple of more things. And is there anyone else at home who uses this computer apart from you? No. All right. And uh, are you calling from U.S. or U.K., sir? U.S. U.S. And which part of U.S. U.S. do you reside? Like which, uh, which, which state? Yes. New York. New York. Oh, that's a very nice city. Do not worry if the line goes silent anytime. That's because uh, I'm working on the computer. At times I go silent. Sorry about that. Okay. So, what are your hobbies? Ah. Uh, oh no. What do you do in the past time? Uh, Hello? I Mainly just what like. Do, what do you do in your. Mainly just watch like YouTube or go skateboarding or something. I'm running a scan on your computer now to trace what kind of viruses are there in the computer like. Okay. As you told me last time you were on the internet, uh, you were using internet, so what were you trying to search exactly? Which link you were using? I was just going on to YouTube. Sorry? I was, go I was going on to YouTube. YouTube, okay. And who's your internet provider? Time Warner Cable. Is it Verizon? Sorry? It's Time Warner Cable. Taiwan Cable. And as you can see, this uh, Windows firewall can help prevent hackers or malicious software from go gaining access to your PC through the internet or a network. So this is showing off. Did you did you disconnect it or something? Did you turn it off? Uh, no. Right, because somehow this is showing turned off. Maybe because of the virus then.
you see do you see uh, this um, it's showing your address and at times it is showing uh, I mean in some places it's showing time bay do you know what is this uh, no actually it says that there are foreign objects in your computer which should not be can you help me with your serial number uh, I mean computer serial number if you flip the computer, if you flip the laptop, you'll be able to see it. Is that a laptop you're using? It, no, it's a desktop. It's a desktop, okay. Okay, I'll find it for you, don't worry then, if it's a desktop. Okay. I'm just trying to check the warranty of this computer, so bear with me. Okay. on this computer sir so we won't be able to fix the issue for free so what I could do here today is I can provide you a warranty on this computer as well as a technical support by fixing the issue of the computer and that would cost you two, $299 and you'll get unlimited tech support in this plus if you have any printer or any other peripheral device at home that will be protected and this issue will be taken care of the virus will be taken uh, taken off by a third level technician by using the advanced devices advanced tools they will have to remove this virus from your computer plus like you'll, com your computer will be insured for one year so if you face any kind of software issues any kind of problem you can always give us a call and uh, we'll be able to help you because we are open here 24 by 7 and we provide unlimited technical support for our customers and this is a transferable service suppose in future you bring any other com computer you can get the services transferred to the other computer as well okay. if you tell me I, I can go ahead and assign a technician then Okay, I was just curious of something on here. Uh, yeah, pause it and check. This one, this. Uh, where was it? Uh, this. I was just curious, is, is this real? Yeah, of course you can check. Oh, well, could you try something? Could you click something for me? What do you want me to click? This big button here. Could, could you click that for me?
Yeah. Just pause. Yeah, just click it. The, the big, the blue one, with the text. You just have to click it. Hello? 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 Yeah, just bear with me, I'll do yeah. that. Yeah, I was just asking if you could click this. Oh. I did. It says, I guess, so that means you're a scammer then. This... No, we are not. This high-tech software just said, I guess you are. And you clicked it. I didn't click it. You clicked it. Where it says, is you a scammer? So that means you're a scammer. Correct? No, sir. We are not scammers. Then we why... We provide technical support. Look, it... It said, you clicked it, and it said you're a scammer, so I, I don't think it would lie. Sir, if you feel that we are not genuine, then definitely oh, I'm not just saying, you to buy anything or... I'm not saying I don't feel you're not genuine. You I'm know. just saying the software has spoken, and it says you're a scammer. Just saying, you know. it. You clicked it. I didn't click it. You clicked it, and it said you're a scammer. Right. Okay, I'll 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 transfer you to a technician. You can speak to him, and he'll be able to answer your questions. Hold on. Okay. All right. Oh, that's funny. Hello. 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 Hey. Yeah. Tommy. Yeah. Hi, Tommy. How are you? Okay. So what happened here is. Can, can you see my screen? Yeah, I can see your okay. screen. There's written your camera. Yeah, see, she clicked it, and it said she was. Okay. Can you test it too? Can you click it too? Okay. What do you What do you want to do us with that? See, stuff? it says well. it says you're a scammer. Okay. With an explanation so mark. Well, here, here's what I want to okay. tell you. I, I made this software. Let me tell you one Here, no, can I tell you something? I made this software, so I actually know quite a lot about computers. And I know what you're doing right now is totally unlegitimate. Okay. And, uh, but you're having the virus problem in your computer. Don't you believe that? Uh, no, I just went to the pop-up link. You see, um, if we go here, go to Task Manager, let's close out Google Chrome. Task. And let's open back up Google Chrome. Go here, go to history, right? And click. Oh no, it's back. See, totally fake. Okay. I can see that as well, but let me tell you one thing. Do you have any kind of technical support and do you have any kind of serial number for your computer? Can you find me the serial number of your computer if you are so much uh, technical? Um, why would there be a serial number in a virtual machine? It's a virtual machine, you're yeah. using a virtual machine, you're not using even a genuine machine, genuine Windows, uh, you don't have a genuine Windows copy and you're calling yourself a technician? Um, it's a virtual machine, you retard. I have a genuine Windows copy. Okay. You hear my computer? Yeah, I can hear that. So, uh, tell me, Tommy. So, if you want, if you want, if you think I'm not genuine, and you think I'm just lying, you could go to my YouTube channel right now. Mm -hmm. Go to youtube.com slash e slash scammer. Right? And you just, you know, watch my videos. You know, see for yourself if I'm not genuine. See for yourself. E. See for yourself. Um, or you could just go to my website and see if I'm not genuine there, too. Go here, see if I'm not genuine. You know, or, or even the fact that I just that I that I know that this is a scam should be proof enough. But and you could go and actually download that software that I made. You know, in our software section, you could download it. Um, we also have a web browser. You can also download that too. So you're totally open to see if I'm not genuine, and you could do that, huh? 
how does that software works? Could you please elaborate me the programming of that software you have uh, just generated that whether you're a this? or not and it, every time it's showing yes, every time it's um, showing yes. Well, basically, it's just linear code, so whenever you... Can you click there? Can you click there? Oh, yes, it says the same thing every time, because it's linear code, and basically, okay. it has to execute a task before it executes the next task. So the first task is you clicking the button, and the second task is it displaying, you know, the text um, in a message box. Uh, we also have website here, links. Okay. You can go to all of our websites. Huh? Are you a scammer? It's also saying you that you're a scammer. Are you a scammer as well? Oh, it's not. It doesn't actually have any algorithm or anything like that. It's just, it's just a troll software to mess with scammers. Okay. Yeah. So what exactly? What kind of help I do you need now? Oh, I never needed help. I'm just recording this for my YouTube channel to get all your services shut down. I mean, thank you for the evidence, though. Okay. Is there anything else? Aren't you going to say you're welcome? All your funny purposes. My funny purposes? Says the guy stealing money from people. Yeah. No, it's nothing like that. We provide oh, technical what? support. To you provide them. technical support? You, you know. The issues with the printers. When they have the issues with the peripheral devices, you, you are not there to fix their issues. We fix their issues. No, you don't. That's you steal problem. people's money. You provide fake pop-ups and steal people's money. It's nothing like I, that, I could fix someone's issue in less than 40 minutes, and the thing about it is I could do it for free because the issues that you guys supposedly fix aren't actually issues at all, and all it involves is going into the task manager and closing Google Chrome and then getting maybe an ad blocker or something and blocking that website from being displayed. So it's not really a hard issue to fix, and the fact that you're charging almost $300 for something that's not an issue at all is extremely retarded, and to you to act like you're a technician is really funny. If you want to be an actual technician, you can get an actual job and actually help people. Okay, so you call yourself a technician, go and help people. Okay, is there anything else I can help you out with, buddy? You know, I can't even explain okay. your okay. logic, your freaking logic. It's... What exactly do you want me to help? Why are you still going with your script? Like, is there anything else I can? Help if you're a technician, you okay. Here, yeah, let's 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 do a little test. If you're a technician, what's a? Oh, you should know this. What's a VPN? I'm sorry. What's a what's a VPN? If you're a technician. DP, DPN. Yeah, VPN. What do you know? What a VPN is? No, I didn't know about VPN. What kind of VPN you are talking about? You don't know what a virtual what private network is? Are you freaking kidding? Okay, do you know yeah. what a NAS is? Do you know what a NAS is? NAS? NAS, N-A-S. Okay, tell me one thing. Which one network attached you? storage. You don't know anything. You are not a technician. You are a retard reading off a script. How does it feel to have a crappy job? feel good, huh? Just going around, oh yeah, I'm gonna scam them. Right? That's your job. Is there anything else I can help you out there, Tommy? Oh my gosh, you're a retard. You know what? You know what would help me out? You wanna really know what would help me out right now? Do, do you wanna know? Yeah, surely I wanna know. Okay. Well, what help me out right now is you stand up, right? You stand up and you walk out of your little shack that you're in and you never touch a computer again or steal somebody's money again. How about that? That would help me out. Okay. God, you're a retard. Just, just shut the hell up. Shut, shut the hell up and just... God, you're a retard. No, you're a... What? You stole the money from the people. You don't want them to go to the real technicians. You are a big scammer, I think. So goodbye and I'm a big scammer because 2,000 people think that I'm legit. Sure, go ahead. How retarded.
chat box doesn't even close. Alright, well that's pretty much it. Thank you for watching, and if you guys stay down here, if you don't mind following my Twitter, at Scammer Vaults, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.